Hi, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you a Vidnami slash NVIDIA slash Lumen5 alternative. I'm Vince from Digital Nomad Institute, and let's get started. Okay, so before we begin, I just want to quickly update everyone on Vidnami. So Vidnami, which was formerly known as Content Samurai, is currently being purchased or bought out by GoDaddy Studio Platform. And with that, their service as Vidnami will end and it will probably reboot. Um, for more about that, you can go ahead and check the link in the description. I'll leave it down for you so you can go ahead and read but with this, Vidnami, for those of you who don't know, is basically an AI video editor. And what it does is it can take your text and create a text video like this one right here where you see just the, the video and um, you see text, highlighted text right here. And it does it automatically. Now, Vidnami, Lumen5, and other AI video editors such as uh, this, they charge a monthly fee. All right, so for those of you who want to find a cheaper alternative, I have one right here. And I understand, like, you know, not everyone can afford or wants to, wants to pay for a monthly service. Um, you know, I can understand that completely. Right, so this is the alternative to those. And right here, it's called Narakeet. It was formerly called Video Puppet. Now, it keeps changing its name. <laughs> I'm going to leave the link in the description below so you can check it out. But uh, if you don't, you don't even have to register and you can create 10 videos, all right? But if you do register, you can create longer videos, up to 50 scenes each, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and um, create an account and I'll show you on what's on the inside. So the way this works is you can upload either a Word document or PowerPoint and it will create a video from your PowerPoint or if you just upload a Word document, it will just create an audio file using text-to-speech so um, let me see the well, one we're interested right now now the functionality that you know is very similar to in video is this one right here and you know if you go ahead and click this one right it'll show you all the instructions so the first thing you can do is you have to if you want to add the narration text for the text-to-speech to read read for you each slide you add it into the presenter's notes um, alternatively you can add a live you know narration your own audio and attach it here and it will just play it and then once you do that you just uh, save all the presentation embedded fonts and then you upload it here okay so I'm gonna show you a quick example right here alright so if you look at this this is very very basic but um, you know, this is the first slide. This is the second slide. All right, so you just type whatever you want over here. You go ahead and continue right here. All right, so then finally over here, and lastly, this is the other text. All right, so uh, if you want to add any any text to speech narration, okay, you can add it here in the presenter notes. All right, so hi, welcome to my video. It'll read that out, and then the next one. Uh, let's say I just want this to be read out. I just copy this and I will paste it here. All right. And then lastly, I will also let me see, uh, add in the my own voice. Okay, so if I want to add in my vo own voice, I just record it, record the audio, and then I um, for this slide, and then it will automatically play. Okay, so you know you can either do one or the other, and a good thing is you don't have to time it or anything. You just read it. You just read this out at your own pace, and then once it's done, it will automatically go to the next uh, slide. You don't have to time anything. Okay, that, that's the beauty of this. So then, once you're done, you have this is the important factor. Now you have to download the Google slide and download it as a PowerPoint. Okay, so once it's downloaded as a PowerPoint, you go back here, you upload the file. All right, so now that the file is uploaded, you just wait for it. I'm going to let it load in real time so you get a feel of what it's like. 
But the good thing is this is a web-based tool, so you can run this on mobile if you want to, right? You don't have to download anything, install. You don't have to, you don't need a Windows PC or you know a Mac. All you do is just go to the website and go ahead and upload your PowerPoint. And wait for it to load. Okay, then if any issue comes up, um, it will let you know. So it says some slides are missing narration text, so they will be without so so sound. Slides three. You can go ahead and add narration. And then uh, the other one is the presentation use animation and tra transitions, which are not yet supported by Narrakee. All right, so there will apply without um, animation, and that's fine. Uh, this one I just left blank because I just want to show you the gist of how it works and uh, not get too involved in it. But uh, let's see. I just let me see. Ignore warnings, and it says you're ready. All right. So let's see. You can now uh, create the video. You can edit. So let me show you the edit. Uh, it has uh, the size, it has language. Now, this is going to be the language of the um, narrator. All right? So let me just see if I can move the mic real quick so you can, you can hear the uh, text-to-speech. New York City traces its origins to a trading post founded by colonists from the Dutch Republic in 1624 on Lower Manhattan. All right. Uh, I don't really like this guy, so I'm going to go with, let's see, Bill. New York City traces its origins to a trading post founded by Cop. All right, let's go with uh, oh, let's try Jeff. New York City traces its origins to a. Tra All right, I'm gonna go with the first guy. All right, and then um, from there, you can go ahead and preview it if you want to. I'm just gonna go ahead and create the video. So now that it's done, it's gonna build your video and load everything. Yeah, this one this one could take a while depending on how many slides and how much audio and uh, graphics that you have on your PowerPoint. But as you can see, it's it's quite easy. You know, you don't have to, um, you know, you don't have to do really, do much. Or once you build your PowerPoint, add in the images and the text, and the you can either add your own narration or you can just have the text to speech do it for you. And then you just click a few buttons and you're good to go. Now I'm gonna let it load for a bit more. I don't want to. I don't want you to, you know, wait because it can't. It will take a while. And then uh, we'll get back. I'll get back to you. Okay, it's ready. It just took a few minutes, and I'm gonna click play so you can get a quick sample of what it's gonna look like. Hi, welcome to my video. Hi, I'm Vince from the Digital Nomad Institute. Are you tired of buying junk from JVZoo or waste money on Warrior Plus or ClickBank products that don't perform as promised? I've been there and done that. I got so sick and tired of it that I decided to do something about it. How we can help. And free alternative software. Join now. Hi, welcome to my video. Okay, there you go. I'm gonna leave. Um, I'm gonna leave a, a version of this, a link to a version of this that you can see. Um, one of it will have the live. One of one of it will have this sample, so you can you know hear the uh, text to speech portion of it, and then the other one will have my recorded voice, so you can actually uh, hear and see the difference. But as you can see, uh, it's pretty good. You don't have to have a screen capture software and click next. You don't have any of that hassle. All you have to do is just click the PowerPoint, add your slide, add your text, and then you know your your presenter notes, and you're done. And it wraps it all up for you. So this is a great alternative for those of you who don't want to be tied into a monthly plan uh, with Lumen Five or um, you know Vidnami or Nvidia. Uh, personally, if you want the free version, this is by far the best. This is what I've used when I couldn't afford, and I, uh, the other other um, software. And uh, once I was, you know, able to afford the other software, I upgraded to um, which one was it? Nvidia, right? Because out of all the AI video editing softwares, you know, 
it was the best because it can do several different tasks, whereas the other ones, such as Lumen 5 and Venami, can only do one, which is basically take text into turn it into a video. But if you want more about that, I'll, I have a link in the description for a review. You can go ahead and check it out. Um, all right, so I hope this video was helpful, and if it was, could you please hit that like button? I'm Vince from Digital Nomad Institute, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.